Hi, Danny Lewis, AT Controls in Cincinnati. In today's video, we're going to be showing our APL310 series limit switch. A few tools we're going to need for today's calibration is a fluke meter, screwdriver, and clean shop air. About the APL310 limit switch is IP67 Type 4 4X approved, including captive screws in the cover, a high visibility indicator, and it is polyethylene powder coated inside and outside for superior corrosion performance. It comes standard with two single pole double throw switches, a 10 terminal strip block, four hookups for solenoid valves, and today we're just going to basically show you how to calibrate the switches. To calibrate your limit switches is a basic twist and turn limit switch configuration cams. At the top switch is your closed switch, which is red, and your bottom switch is your open switch, which is green, which is color coded with your indicator cap. So, using a fluke meter, you set it to continuity, and we are in our clockwise position. So, we are going to check terminals two and three for continuity, which we have. So, basically, if you need to set this switch, like I said, it's a push and turn switch. So we are in a fully closed position, and if you listen, you will hear the switch trip. Once it trips, you want to go one spline past the trip and check for continuity again. So your top switch is set. Now we're going to rotate the actuator counterclockwise with clean shop air. And check continuity for our bottom switch. which this is set also. The same concept as the top, it's just a pull and turn switch. Which the bottom switch is set. Now that the limit switches are calibrated correctly, I'm going to remove the shop air and replace the indicator dome to check for proper rotation. Counterclockwise position, which is the open position. Remove the air and we'll show closed. And that is the proper calibration of our APL 310N limit switches. Thank you. Hi, I'm Brian Wright. Thanks for watching this video. Hope you found it helpful. We always have engineers and our highly qualified technicians at the ready for any of your questions. For further information, go to atcontrols.com or call us at 513 247 5465. As always, we thank you for your business.